move and be the hero. Get up, move and be the hero. Hi, I'm Lonne Kolierouk. I'm the COO of the Ocean Cleanup. It's the Ocean Cleanup's mission to develop advanced technologies to rid the world's oceans of plastic. We want to uh, reduce the concentration of floating plastic in the oceans with 90% by 2040. System uh, 1 is a floating tube, a flotation device with a skirt attached beneath it. The skirt is underwater for about 3 meters. That system uh, will move around the ocean in a C-shape or a U-shape, uh, catching up on the plastic, collecting it inside of it. We care so much about the marine life and how much harm the plastic is doing to it. So in designing this system, we've taken great care not to have any adverse effect, effect on the wildlife that's out there. Our system is not uh, uh, propelled at all, uh, apart from uh, the natural forces of the ocean. It is propulsed by the forces of nature. It is uh, designed to be a passive uh, cleaning up system. My name is Laurent Le Breton. I'm the lead oceanographer for the ocean cleanup. And basically we study plastic pollution in the ocean. So it means understanding the sources, the transport and the fate of plastic in the ocean. I think uh, we're seeing that uh, microplastic pollution in particular is increasing uh, substantially over the last few years and I think it's very important to understand that we need to stop putting plastic in the ocean. So plastic are being released in the ocean and they basically move um, with currents, with wind and wave and it accumulates in the subtropical waters in the North Pacific particularly um, in what we call uh, the subtropical gyres and those are areas where basically the currents are converging and marine debris accumulate. It does, it does migrate, uh, but it stays relatively in the same area, but it moves. Uh, there is five accumulation uh, zones in the same, same type, so one in each oceanic basin. We believe the one in the North Pacific is the largest. Well, I think they can start by reducing the use of plastic, uh, particularly single-use plastic, I think is, is one, one big topic. And, and also, I think that cleanup matters. Uh, you know, anytime you go to the beach, to rivers, forests, in natural environments, if you find trash, it's always good to just pick it up and put it in the bin, right? Our system one is a beta type version. It's the uh, minimum viable product, so and it actually works. So it is the intent to start cleaning up, but we want to uh, learn from it for this first uh, year of operation and collect a lot of valuable information. In order to be able to clean up 50% in five years, we need multiple cleanup systems. So we are now launching our first system, the system one. Uh, which will prove the concept and will give us enough information so that we can implement it in a redesign in the next generation of cleanup system, which should be even bigger and better and more productive. We intend to scale up and we need a fleet of about 60 of those types of systems. We're in a bit of a hurry because we do see the risk of the plastic that's currently out there breaking down into smaller pieces, which will cause even more harm. So we really want to get as much out now that it's still big, uh, as soon as we can. Uh, so we do have some ambitions, ambitious plans to scale up fast. Uh, we believe that we will have the fleet of uh, 60 systems uh, in operation by 2021. Um, so, of course, next few months are going to be super tense. Uh, this, is, this is an exciting moment, but of course the moment we're mo looking most forward to is to bring this first plastic back to shore. It's, you know, because that means that it's proven technology and that's what we hope to achieve with this first system. So the idea is that we take the plastic back to land and um, we work together with our recycling partners uh, and the idea is that we can uh, process that plastic and turn it into very nice, desirable products uh, that are durable, designed to not end up back into the oceans and uh, by selling those, we actually hope to, um, to help fund the cleanup uh, uh, and uh, fund the operations of the cleanup system. So next few months, uh, I'll be uh, really obsessively looking at the data that's coming in uh, from the vessel, from the data streams, from the cleanup system, 
uh, which will hopefully then allow us to catch the first plastic and bring it to land.